Alright, good morning, boys and squirrels, and welcome to day 49 of The Completionist, the quest for legendary items. Here we go. I'm hoping this works. So the only thing we gotta be quick with is, uh, if we do get some baddies that aren't the regular baddies, switching this really quick to the overcharge energy cells, but I don't want to use them yet, you know? I honestly want to just use the shotgun. It's gonna take them a minute to break through this door right here anyway. The iron door, and of course since I put these up, I can't just open the damn thing. But boy am I hoping they just freaking go through the damn door. And I've been looking at them just randomly here. There's one way over here. But he's like stuck on something. So no one's coming yet. But here we go. Let's see how this goes. Boy do I hope they come down this little hole. Whoa. <laughs> I'll keep this out. As Horde Night starts, and we'll see if we're going to get lucky or if they're going to just beat up from on top of us. Alright, here they all come. My senses have picked up something. Oh, what the hell is that? It's like they're stuck on the house somewhere. Okay, he's in here. Okay, here we go. Man, I wish I could break that damn door. Oh, shit. Maybe I need to break the door. Alright, one second. Because now it seems like they're busting through to the side. So let me let me break this door. Okay, here we go. Now come, guys. I'm just going to keep shooting you in your damn kneecaps. Oh, shit. Yeah, here they come. No, no, no. Okay. We need to make sure this is strong. These are all... Okay. There we go. Nope. 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 Come on. They're just breaking the house. It's not like they're, they're going down either, though. Alright. This is gonna sound crazy. But we're going to get the hell out of here. I'm going to try to jump on the roof. There's a small chance I die. But I, I want to kill zombies throughout the night because they give me the best chance of getting drops. You know? I, I can't get that if they're not going to come. Yeah, I know we're not. Oh, yeah, oh now you're... There we go. It's a little weak? I don't know. Alright. Dude. Keep coming. Good. Oh, shit. No, I don't. Who's that giant fucking dude? Like, what is that? There he is. Radiated Titan. We destroyed him. Whoa! Get back, dick finger! Okay. So, obviously, it was way too strong. Let's just get rid of this door, then, too. Okay. Now, I need these big-ass radiated titans and shit to drop something. Dude, they're not dropping anything. Oh, there you are. And a hell wolf. Dude, this is what I want. Like, bring it on. There's one. Yes! He doesn't keep his head still. Who gains back health very, very slow, but... There's a good one. 
There we go. No. Nope. You're so full of shit. Oh shit. Alright, I'm gonna wait for my weapon to get fixed and then I'm heading on up. I'm getting the hell out of here. This Horde Knight sucks. Yeah, we're gonna try to get the hell out of here. It's gonna be sketchy. For sure. Like, why are you not using it? Ow! Like, that was rude. Oh, is she blocking them all in? This is how little I care about you guys. Oh, no! Fucking bird. Okay, that was very close to death. I should have cared more. Is that the fucking bird? Dude, bring them on. I'm out here in the open. Whoa! What was that? Oh, just a booger. They're all just fucking stuck places. I don't think I will. Call him bullshit. At this point, I wish I would have freaking done him back in my other place. <gasps> Whoa! There we go. There we go. Big dogs. Ow, bitch. I haven't switched over to the little shit dick ammo. Oh. Fucking bird, man. This... This... Sucked. Just because they couldn't get to me, so it... it Nerfed a lot of the zombies that were actually going to come. Man, that sucked. Let me figure out my inventory really quick. We'll get it all sorted. We'll probably head back to base. Because then we can craft the what's a doozy for us. The overcharged energy cell. And then we legit may upgrade the game by using that hell. Unleash hell. Yeah, I think that might legit be the way to go. It's going to make the game 100% harder. But, like, we're in-game. We we want it. I think we want it. We'll probably regret saying it, but... Fucking suck. Oh, wait, Bernice! She took a damn 
fireball, I think, to the face. She's seen better days. All right. Uh, now time to head back. There we are. Looky there. Like a straight professional. All right, here we are. Let's uh go up here. Oh, you're thirsty? Suck it up. All right. Search chicken coop. Boom. Tons of eggs. Tons of eggs. Well, sort of tons. And there should be a whole bunch of honey. Oh, yeah. Nice. Okay. Now I gotta come out here. Hit this shit. Ugh. This garden, man. This garden. Let's, uh... I don't know if... Yep. Okay. How far we've come, garden-wise. I need way more tomatoes in this thing, right? No, 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 no. I went out and hit a whole bunch of tomatoes. We should be good on tomatoes. When I was, went out and got a whole bunch of... What's he doozies? Apples. Apples for the apple... Or the animal feed. I went and got a whole bunch of tomatoes also. I was hoeing everything. Okay. Here we go. Need to get a whole bunch of ink. I want to save the blueberries if I can. So first we use our tomatoes. Oh, yeah, dude. This is going to be fine. Six. That's all our eggs. I should have probably made more chicken coops. That should be okay, though. All right. Really quick, as I'm putting stuff up, I'll show you. You haven't seen the base in quite a while. I was back right after streaming on Saturday. But just give a massive shout out to the Patreon members as well as YouTube members in general. Links down below if you ever want to donate or anything like that. It's never necessary or expected, but just appreciated. I, uh, Molly's used to say, I think, vehicles. So if you saw my video a couple days ago, well, like, that came out this last Monday to where top five things I want seven days to die to add to the game, I was showcasing the uh, universal crafting. So I ended up making another one on this guy just to show what it looked like, you know. And I put it into Molly's vehicles. Well, it it gets rid of the name. And I couldn't remember exactly what the name was. And it's not just Molly's vehicles now. Now it's like everything. So we switched it to Molly's secret stuff. So just another big shout out to Patreon members. Love you guys. And YouTube members. Man, we have so much honey. But this is what hers looks like now. Like, look at all the money we have. And the bad thing is we could have, we could have had so, so much more. But we've been scrapping so much shit because there's been no purpose, you know. Looky here. So we've gotten two, four, six, seven, but eight because one of them's on my item now. Eight Toby's Balance and Axe, two Ashes Chainsaw, two Eric's Hammers, two Kane's Patreon Funds, two Jason's Machete. One Master Sergeant Porkins shotgun, uh, one Knuckles, and then one Lucky Rabbit's foot, and then one Mythic Steno Shades, which just leads us with the Fail Knot, Lucille, and Black Sky. Dude, I'm very, very, very much considering maxing this out, you know, uh, doing this Unleash Hell. Can we do it now? Unleash Hell. What are we missing? Here's a super corn. Okay. I don't know off the top of my head where Grace is or where any super corn is. So, can't actually do that just yet. So, I guess that does give time in the chat. If you want to see me do that and pursue that, let me know. And that'll be something we try to do for sure. Look at all this ammo that I could sell still. It's just insane. Let me put this shit up. Oh my gosh. Half of this up. Okay, so we should be able to make six of these. We have more than enough blueberries. The paper, we got to end up watching if we need more of this. We're going to have to make sure we still keep collecting paper. So a minute to do this, and that will give us 140. No. Damn, only 120. So we're just barely going to be able to do it. You sure I didn't have? You sure about that? You sure about that? Yep. I'm sure about that. Man, thank we... 
went this entire series living on top of a freaking shitter just in the middle of nowhere you know it's crazy with wood that's what's even more crazy and half a ceiling because we tried to make more chicken coops up here and shit gave out or no it wasn't a chicken coops it was this thing wasn't it we put that up there and it just shit out on us huh dude it's been a really really good series and now it's just getting better the overcharged energy cell which will go right here what do we get rid of the reflex sight mod unfortunately dude this thing's gonna be so badass then the shotgun can have this okay here's the plan for today we're stacked we're ready to go we're at end game can i craft any more energy cells i don't think so that was all my blue papers we need more eggs which makes me think let's just go ahead chicken coops no they take eggs to craft don't they Yep. Once we get more eggs, say we get four eggs, we're going to craft two more chin coops because we have so much animal feed. You won't see a freaking apple tree seed or apple tree in quite the distance, most likely. What the hell is that? Chicken? Oh, yay. You? Pull your weight, butthole. Let's craft one of these, and then we'll craft one more. All right, you can be there. And then, boom. Okay. So, we're all set up. Now, the big thing is, what I'm going to do for the rest of the day is look for either a Bob's Boars, which who knows where that'd be, or another place that has super corn. But what the hell place, other place has super corn? But I want to, that's the last thing I want to accomplish today. So, when you see this episode... I hopefully will have 10 super corn because you got to think all I got to do is I think hit just a couple with my hoe because we'll get I think four being out in the wild but we get four of them or well seven of them and we have the opportunity to make or craft a corn you know to craft the unleashed shell so let me look around and see if we can't find one and we'll go from there Holy shit, I think that's it. Yes, 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 that's it. Holy shit, have I drove everywhere. <laughs> this town is badass, though. This town is south of Razor's, or east of Razor's Compound. Dude, it's all giant-ass new buildings. Like, this is like a some circular, I don't know, like a stadium? A giant bank? Dude, there's more. Before I run in and grab this corn, let me show you. This this giant bank, beside this giant bank, there's that giant yellow thing over there. The the place called Collector, it looks like, right beside her. A gallery. I don't know what the hell that says on the side of it. There's a different building right there. Uh, it's hard for me to show. See the satellite right there? And then the blue buildings? There's... That one place we cleared that I couldn't find. Or, oh, no, 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 no. Those are the hidden stashes. We'll have to go check that. And then over there in the distance is from a stream that Muscle Crab and I cleared. The two uh, silo, like, rounded off parts. Down there in the bottom of that bitch is some graces and shit like that. But let's, let's run in here before it gets nighttime. I just, yeah, I ran into this town. Like, I checked so many places. And I know there's probably some besides the... Bob's boars and shit like that, but dude, off the top of my head, I have no idea what they would be, you know. I know this place has it, and this is the only place I'm 100% sure on. And it took forever to find this, so we gotta be careful. There's one upstairs, and then two downstairs? Alright. One right there. Kill these guys. Alright. Watch out, peckerheads. Damn it. Okay. Okay, do I get four? Yes, I do. Good. Okay, downstairs we go. Dude, nobody come. Okay, that's enough. 
That's what we need to clear or to unleash hell. Hey, there's a bunny. There's a bunny. Boop. Whole bunch of bunnies. All right, so let me know down in the comments if you want to see me unleash shell next episode. Just to let you know, I'm leaning toward it. Leaning very hard toward it. And in case you've missed anything, let me show you what unleashing hell does. So, are these the same? They are, so it don't matter. Drinking this item will permanently increase your game stage by 100%. Warning, this cannot be undone. You have been warned. It sounds terrible, but we're at game stage almost 400, so it put us to 800. I don't know what that means. Do all the zombies, would they all just become the worst little bastards on earth? Like, Galleria. What did I say? Collector? Boy, I need to get my eyes checked. I was at an angle. The night is here, boys and squirrels. Uh, here we are. I have it. I'm not going to do it, but I'm curious. I'll put the first comment in the thing will be, should I drink this Unleash Hell? We're in game. We've done it all. We need to kill the, the Demon Lord, and we need the three weapons still. And those can drop from all the demonic beans, you know, so it's, I think it's time. The only thing I got going now is I'm crafting a whole bunch more forged iron to get more electrical parts to get more energy cells. So right now we can craft two. <laughs> but ammo wise, we're still doing well, which makes me think, like, what does it take to calipers required? Do we have another set of calipers? No, in my luck, we don't. Oh, no, we do. We have two sets of calipers, so it's time to make two metal workstations. We'll make two metal workstations, maybe. Forged iron. And electrical parts? <laughs> Damn it. We'll make two more of those just to speed this shit up a little bit, you know? Because the electrical parts take so long, but I'll knock that out. The big question is with you all. Do we do it? Do we give it a chance? I know I can't remember... Uh, their name, but someone in the comments mentioned they didn't do the Unleash Hell, but they talked about how, like, Demon Lords and like that, they're so far into the game that Demon Lords are like a regular zombie. Are we strong enough to face the Demon Lord? I'd hope so, because we really can't increase ourselves or improve ourselves at any point, besides going into this. The al Albalative Armor which we need to get way more schematics again, but that pretty much reduces the chance of being set on fire 10% per mod, so that'd pretty much bump it to 60 maybe? 50 or 60? So that's something we could definitely probably do. I went out and got more ink or more eggs and shit like that, so let's go back to this one. Craft three more of those. But that's going to wrap this episode up. I'm excited and curious to see what y'all say. If you don't want to do it, that's okay. Just let me know in the comments. We'll keep fighting and we'll progress, but we have it. So we could bump it up twice as hard. In worst case scenario, we could go back to here. If it's twice as hard and we're getting those kinds of zombies like all the time, dude, we'll bump that shit up and increase this super hard. Put carbine turrets on this side and be set to go, you know. We could give this base a go. Because if they're spawning anywhere, that would be the goal and the dream. Instead of just being in the wasteland, we can get those bastards to pop up anywhere. Thank you so much for all the support. As always, it means so much. I want to give a special shout out to not only the YouTube members, but the Patreon members. You guys are absolute legends. Thank you so much for all you do for me. If you missed any episodes of this or the Legendary Fister, you can catch them in the playlist. As well as every Saturday, I stream at 7 p.m. Central Time, not only on YouTube, but on Twitch as well. So you can catch that on YouTube or Twitch. I got all the issues fixed with YouTube to where it was very, very far behind. But that shouldn't be an issue anymore. So if you want to watch it on YouTube, feel free. But I will catch you in the next episode. Make sure to like and subscribe. Peace.